Welcome to the channel with your friend Bless Row. Southern cooking is the best, that's one thing we all know. Most comforting meals that everyone will love. Join Bless Row, her cooking comes from the good heart. Recipe so good, you just might get hooked. Join now, Bless Row Cooks. Welcome to Blessed Row Cooks. Today, we are going to be making this delicious, zesty Italian baked chicken. If you are looking for a new baked chicken recipe, or if you're looking for just a delicious baked chicken recipe, you are in the right place. Stay tuned for this quick, easy, and delicious recipe. These are the ingredients that I'm going to be using today. Today, I am going to be baking chicken legs. And to these chicken legs, I'm going to be adding some onion powder, some garlic powder, some zesty Italian salad dressing. And I'm also going to be using some Sweet Smoky Joe's Creole Kick. The Creole Kick is really good. I use it on a lot of stuff. I have been watching Smoking and Grilling with AB for years, and he has been raving about this Creole kick. So, of course, I had to buy me some, and it is really good. If you do not watch Smoking and Grilling with AB, I don't know where you've been, <laughs> but go check him out. And if you have been watching Smoking and Grilling with AB, then you know he uses this Creole kick. The first thing that I'm doing is adding me some of the Italian dressing to the chicken. As you can see, I'm using the Kraft Zesty Italian, but you can feel free to use your favorite Italian dressing. The Kraft Italian dressing works really well for me. It is really good, and so that's what I choose to use. Now I'm going ahead and adding my garlic powder and my onion powder. And then I'm going to add my Creole Kick. If you do not have Creole Kick, you can just skip this step or you can add a low sodium seasoning of your own. Now I'm going to go ahead and massage all of the seasonings into each piece of chicken. Welcome to the channel with your friend Bless Row. Southern cooking is the best, that's one thing we all know. Now I'm getting me a plastic zipper bag and I'm going to put all of my chicken into the plastic zipper bag. After I put my chicken in the bag, I'm going to go ahead and add in the rest of the bottle of the Italian dressing. Then I'm going to make sure all of the air is out and I'm going to just mix it around to make sure that it has full coverage. Now I'm going to put this in the refrigerator and I'm going to let it marinate overnight. If you don't have overnight, try to let it marinate for at least two hours to get that yummy, delicious flavor infused. I let the chicken marinate overnight and now it is finished marinating. So I took it out about 20 minutes ago and I just put it on the countertop and let it sit for about 20 minutes before I put it in the oven. My oven is preheated on 350 and I'm gonna go ahead and get my chicken ready to put in. I have a small foil lined sheet pan that I'm going to be baking my chicken on today. You can use a dish if you want. You can also put these on a rack if you want. But today, this is what I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna be using a foil lined sheet pan. I'm gonna put my chicken in the oven uncovered and I'm going to bake it for an hour. I am getting all of the marinade out of the bag that I can get out. For my chicken, I use less than a small bottle of, of marinade, but 
You can use more than that if you want to or if you need to. And you can also add some Italian dressing to the chicken now if you want more than this to bake your chicken. I did make sure that marinade was underneath each piece of chicken. The chicken is ready. It has finished baking. I have removed it from the oven. And now I'm getting ready to plate it up. While I am plating this chicken up, I want to thank each and every one of you for joining me today. I really appreciate you. I would also like to ask you to give me a thumbs up for this video. Also, if you would like to see more videos from Blessed Row Cooks, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Now I'm pouring the juices that were left over in the pan on top of the chicken. Look at how delicious this chicken looks. I'm going to go ahead and add a little pop of color to it. We're going to add some green to it, make it stand out, make it look all pretty. It looks delicious and it tastes delicious. This is the last baked chicken recipe that you need. Try this chicken today, y'all. Let me know how you like it. Don't forget to leave a comment for me. Give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for joining me today. Have a blessed and beautiful day. And remember to always put God first. Until the next time, y'all, stay blessed. Bye. Turn on your TV screen. Turn on your phone. Turn on your laptop. We're watching Bless Roll. Bless Roll.